The aroma of delicious meatballs filled the air as the Jimmy Meatballs food truck parked at the HCC's Collaboration Studios parking lot to feed customers. Everything is homemade except for the chicken tenders. They're basically crab cakes, but in a ball, so I'll beach balls. They got crab and shrimp in them. The only thing that sucks is when you get a lot of orders, it's easy. A lot of changing gloves because you got crab and shellfish. People can't have that. A lot of people can't have that, so you got to change gloves a lot. Maybe it gets really busy. And Jake, the owner of Jimmy Meatballs, told us gourmet meatballs also include dessert. These are the Death by Chocolate Balls. They're really popular. Some days they're really popular. Some days nobody gets any of them. But it's cake and Nutella and brownies all mixed together and then fried in a funnel cake batter. Cake, Nutella, brownies, Oreos, marshmallows, all mixed together, and then fried in funnel cake. It's like a really good indulgence. Jake led us into his food truck to get some action of him preparing the plates for customers. Now we start finishing dressing the plates. Jake also gave us some exclusive insight to a secret ingredient that he uses, which would be hard to tell if you've seen from the outside. This is the mojo slaw. It goes with the uh, Cuban, uh, I'm sorry, it goes with the clean barbecue. Cross them in a red chili sauce. That's homemade. I stole that from Koji, the most famous food truck in LA. I stole that recipe from them. So if it's good enough for the best food truck in LA, it should be good enough for me. Beach balls are done. They look dark, they always look dark because uh, my secret ingredient, I use graham crackers, graham cracker crumbs, the graham cracker crumbs are already dark. So they look dark, but no, this is the way they're supposed to be. And then you cover them in sauce anyway, so nobody thinks they're burnt. The food truck is parked in front of the HCC Collaboration Center, where they hope to have a new food truck every week here. The employees enjoyed the convenience of Jimmy's food truck, and most importantly, the food. What is your opinion about the food truck? Well, I haven't tried this one today. I tried the one on Tuesday, and it's delicious. I'm, I'm happy with the convenience, because with meetings, sometimes we don't have the full time to, to spend to go out to eat, and it's tiring and boring to bring lunch every day. So I'm really happy about having the food trucks here. And I ordered the buffalo shrimp from Jimmy over there, Jimmy's Meatballs, and it's delicious. And I can't wait to also go upstairs and eat the Death by Chocolate Ball for dessert. Oh, I think it's great. Food comes right to us. And for one guy cooking back there, it was actually pretty quick. And uh, like I said, the food's delicious. Definitely, this Jimmy Meatballs food truck was a crowd pleaser. Keep an eye out for more fruit trucks like this one to roll into campus. In Tampa, Brianna Wickfall, Hawk TV News.